a chicken in every pot. Isn't that what Hoover said? Well, here we have a chicken in a pot, a little different than maybe back then. It's covered in water and also a little rice wine, little sesame oil, and probably half cup of so soy sauce. With this chicken, I'm going to cook carrot in this order, carrots, onions, green onions, daikon you see in the middle of the left side plate. And then second round is going to be uh, bok choy, cut into two types, the stalk and sort of the leaf, and also bean sprouts. So again, we're going to break it up into two groups because it's two different sorts of vegetables. Root vegetables, the daikon and carrot, ginger, they're going to take a little bit longer to cook down. Also the green onion, all of these things are root vegetables. So um, we'll cook them with the chicken. And as we're cooking this chicken, we're just going to simmer it. It's going to be like making chicken stock. We are going to make chicken stock. In fact, if you happen to have chicken stock, it'd be tastier to use the chicken stock instead of water. But uh, we're going to use water. And with all these vegetables and a nice big chicken, you're going to get uh, quite a nice stock from this. And that's what we will serve it with. The second round vegetables, the bok choy and uh, the bean sprouts, are going in later because they cook very quickly. We'll also put uh, tofu in at that time. You may have some guest who doesn't eat meat, but they're, you know, they're not a diehard vegan or anything, and they'll have a little bit of chicken stock. Well, they can eat the tofu. Yeah, chicken in every pot. Maybe Mr. Obama will get us the chicken in every pot. We will have to see. But this chicken is going to take, I'm going to really, really delicately simmer it, pretty much just steep it for about two hours. I want to make sure it's totally cooked. You see now we've passed two hours and uh, the volume of the liquid is reduced quite dramatically, probably by 10-15%. And our chicken is cooked, our root vegetables are cooked. Here's our cooked chicken. See, it's very pale, but that skin's delicious. It's still nice and fatty, it's very buttery. And now I've added in the second round vegetables. You see the green bok choy and the bean sprouts throughout, and also the tofu. And so to serve this dish, uh, I butchered the chicken, cut the chicken, or carved, I should say, the chicken, and uh, I will basically spoon my vegetables out into this very large bowl and then place my chicken pieces and if you want to see how to carve a chicken check out my other video on how to carve a chicken on uh, this Thrift Culture Now YouTube channel. So my carved chicken will go on top of these vegetables and then I'll pour my stock over top and then the, the green tops of the uh, spring onions or green onions that we used in the first round of the cooking. Those green tops are going to go on top as you can see just as a garnish and there we have it. This bowl is probably almost two feet in diameter so this is a nice family meal.